GMB, the show that's on before me, of course, um, they did a survey with floating voters and they found out, I'll just look at the figures here, 44% of these voters thought you were weak, 40% thought you were weird, and you and Nigel Farage are the least trusted at 21%. Now, how Apart do you deal... Apart from that, it was a great success. Yeah, it was really good. <laughs> how do you deal with that, though? I mean, that's really difficult to deal with, surely. Well, look, that's not my impression from what I'm getting from people as I go around the country. I think people are understanding and seeing the real me rather than the caricature. Um, and uh, I think people are hearing what we're talking about and the way we want to change the country. And, you know, I've probably said this to you before, I'm not trying to win a photo opportunity competition, and if I did, I probably wouldn't win it. Um, I'm trying to win a, a, an election about ideas and about how we change the country for working people. And, and if people want somebody who'll stand up for their principles, you know, against the energy companies, I'm, I'm going to freeze energy bills till 2017, someone who'll stand up to the tax avoiders, the banks, Rupert Murdoch, which I've done in this parliament, that's what they'll get from me as Prime Minister, always putting working people first. Now, look, I have to talk a bit to you about your new status as a sex symbol. I feared you might. <laughs> I, it's not that funny. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, I shouldn't laugh. That's really rude. You're as um... surprised as my wife, I think, about it.